Hey, hey, crafty people of the world unite. Woohoo! Just kidding. Can you tell I miss my craft room? I swear I haven't had any time to play lately in this room and I need to get in here and just relax. It's, um, I think it's equivalent to exercising for peace of mind and clarity. What do you guys think? All right. Um, I didn't get to go to the sale on April the 2nd. Did any of you guys go? Did you find some good dyes? If you did and you made a video, uh, please leave the link in the description bar below or just let me know and I can come check your page out. And if you don't have a YouTube, you should. Or, or you could just write and let me know which dyes you found or which you were the most excited about. I did not get to go because I was running the... Okay, rucking, because we only ran walk. Um, the Color Me Rad in downtown Virginia Beach. That was so fun. It was a 5K. So we got super messy with lots of color powder and it was just um, kind of muddy, but it was still fun. So we had a good time there. But even though I haven't been playing in my craft room, I have bought some really cool stuff because I can't help myself. I've tried. I've tried, I've tried, I've tried. Um, and they just have way too good of deals and I can't do it. But as you see, I have no dice. I didn't see anything that was like, I have to have. And maybe that's because everybody bought it on April 2nd. I don't know. So let me know if you guys got some good stuff. This is what I found. I found this very cool kid. Um, these are canvas little flags. You can see there's four of them. And I love this Be Brave. Love, love, love that. Here's a SKU number. I will leave the hotline number down below in the description. You can call it. You can enter the SKU number and your zip code and see if your store has it locally. I think that's a really good deal. I also found these cute little U. They are six clips. You can see they just look like bobby clips with these little epoxy images on them. And as you saw, that one did say baby, but um, I don't think they have to be used for babies. Where's this cute number? Here they were, they were $1.50, 49. That was really fun. These Maggie Homes. There's 18 of these little tassels. Aren't they so cute? I mean, just think of all the different uses you could use those for. I believe I was watching 504 Pretty Things and she was talking about just making a banner on a card with them. I was like, that's so, yes, yes. Um, then I grabbed some of this extreme double-sided tape. This is $1.50 and this is... A little bit thicker let's see a qu one quarter inch wide and six yards so that's a really good find I picked one of these up I've been um, leaving a new one because my tip bent so I wanted to grab this and you can use it to poke holes through your die cuts you can use it for brads it's just a fun and handy tool and it was $3.99 and it's by we are memory keepers so I thought that was pretty neat. Oh, here's another tape. This one was only 79 cents. There's a SKU number. This one is one eighth of an inch. Look how tiny that is. You can't even see that. There you go. Look, look at that. Super thin. I should have grabbed more of those. Super cool. Uh, we got these cute thickers. Does it say where they are? Page. By American Craft. And it's so cool because they're like two pages of it. And I guess because they're bigger and they got all the numbers, but look at all the different styles, different patterns. I was really excited about these. Look at all those hashtags. Yes. Ooh, cute girl. This was 150. Here's the SKU number for that one. I'm interested to see if it's the same as the other one. Oh, look at that. They are the same. You can't see if I'm not in the frame. <laughs> so when this happens, you won't know which piece is gonna be there, which is kind of a bummer. Let's see if the little U is the same one. The little U is the same one too. So that's kind of a bummer because you won't know which piece is there when you call. So I'm sorry about that. You can talk to uh, Tuesday morning about that. Does anybody hear the vacuum going? That's my daughter. But I'm not going to complain because she's doing the floors, right? So, oh, I did grab another one. Look at that. Yes, great minds think alike. Don't you love it? 
I grabbed two of those because I thought they were too cute. All this, oh, here we go. Here's a jelly bean file cards. They're 18 pieces for 99 cents. There's a number. And then just little, and what I was really thinking that these would be cool for, and this lighting is horrible, is for scrapbooking, for journaling behind, when you slide it behind the picture, that's what I was really thinking. Because they're, they're not huge by any means, but you could write on both sides and they have little things that would add to a scrapbook layout. Oh, and look at this one. Cool kid. And this one is stars. Same number, but it says boy things like, so fun, my boy. Hoorah, so rad. And they're stars. And they have, ad they have adhesive on the back. There was also this piece right here, Cool Kids. This was $1.50 and it is the same number. So it looks like what they did for each, for the slide is they just gave it one number and um, same price. So, so I thought these plus signs were pretty cool. And then you got all these stars. These are little paper clips. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't know. I don't know why they did that. They did though. All right. So then we have this. This has been around 99 cents, but you know what? It is getting closer to Halloween. So now I'm starting to think about fall because you know all those cool things are going to be coming out in like um, August, which is sad to say, but it's not that far away. What are we in? April, May, June, July, August, four months. Oh my gosh, this year is flying by. Do you feel the same? So these were $1.50 and they were super cute. There's these little jars that have the cork and the little metal piece and you can you see that got the little place where you can put it on a necklace or string a jump ring or something so there's a number for that i really like those i was thinking maybe some sand um from the beaches like this weekend we're going to the outer banks so i thought that'd be kind of cool so as you can see Seven Gypsy was in the house this week. They were like all over the place and it was totally cool. Um, and I love the prices. Cannot go wrong with 99 cents. This one is the mini ephemera for Harmony. And there's the number. And I mean, it's the cutest stuff. I just got to show it to you. I hope you guys don't mind terribly. I know the lighting is not the best, but look at this stuff. It is single-sided. Murray's. Reminds me of somebody special. I just love these. I really, if I would have found another set of these, I probably would have grabbed them. That is so cute. Diamonds, ceremony, Hawaii. The honeymoon and the wedding songbook. So, 99 cents, that was a done deal. There was no going back. And then this one right here is Wicked Gypsy. Who does not love that name? Wicked Gypsy. I'm like loving it. 99 cents. Again, it's the same thing, it's just some ephemera. And as you can see, I grabbed one and two and three of those because. I have to say, tell you, I, I mean, I'm sure everybody's like, yeah, that's my favorite holiday too. And you know what I think it is? It's just, I think it's supposed to be like that. Huh. It's just fun. It kicks off the holiday season. The weather's cooler. The fun starts. Pumpkin spice is delicious no matter what you put it in. I mean, I just wish they were a little bit bigger. So you can see why I grabbed three. And it's just a fun holiday. There's like no pressure. Sometimes with Christmas and Thanksgiving, there can be a little bit of pressure. Get the food right. But not with Halloween. You just have fun and eat candy and drink pumpkin stuff. Okay, and let's stick with the Halloween. Right here we have printed ATC file folders. They were $1.50. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't realize they were folders. I thought they, I didn't actually read it. I just saw the picture and put it in the cart if I'm honest. Oh, and these are fully, we get two. Oh, sweet. Book of spells. Oh, these are cool. I love that you get two of them. That is super cool. I grabbed one of those. And then I grabbed these ones for, I'm not even checking the numbers to see if they're the same. That is the file folder, so that wouldn't be the same. They are not the same. Very cool. Making a little bit of a mess. I can pick it up later. There's the number. And these ones I grabbed um, because I thought they might be fun to color. I don't know if you'll be able to watercolor them with the paper. I mean, they feel, they don't feel very flimsy, but I figured you could watercolor them or, um, you know, just color them with your markers maybe. We got some palm trees. They are single-sided, but it have the anchor. So that's me, all about anchors. I'm wondering, my husband is getting ready to retire from the Navy, and I wonder if I'll still always be about anchors, but it's been our life for like 24 years, and we're about to uh, leave that behind. Oh, and this one was super cute, too. And I'm just kind of curious. My sister says she thinks I'll always like anchors. We shall see. So I grabbed two of those. And let's go with this one. Here's this one. This is another um, folder, file folders, printed ATC. And it is called From Journey, the collections from Journey. And I'm really, really sorry about this. There you go. ones I actually put back the first time but then I grabbed in the second when I saw the folders because I thought they were kind of cool. I mean if I really don't like what's on them I could definitely cover them with paper or I could use them as a outline to make my own but this one was pretty generic. I thought it'd be pretty easy to use. And look at that. So, some of these I will definitely be able to use them as they are. But some of them might be used. Covered up with paper. We'll see. This one was 99 cents, and this is a cute book cover. It's Paris, but it's not very big at all. It's literally five and a half tall by three and a half wide, approximately. And these are just like chipboard covers and these are super thick. They're blank on the inside. They have detail on the back and front and you're supposed to be able to just use these to put together an adorable mini book. There's a sample. Isn't that neat? So there was two and I grabbed two because 99 cents and making a book that fast would be super awesome, right? 49 cents for labels. This is the chemistry number one. They did have one that was blank and it was also 49 cents, but I didn't, I didn't have a use for that one. And look at these dome studs. You get 12 pieces. And they were $1.50, which I thought might be just a little overpriced. But I did see lots of uses for these in cards as well as scrapbook layouts. I thought they would be fun. They had some vintage pins. Here's a SKU number there for 150. Look at those. Aren't they cute? They did have some um, like hanger clothes pins and some round clothes pins that had the little hook on the end where you could put string. So here's one. It's got the Cute little number. There you go. See that? Look at the 
detail. So cute. So for $1.50, I thought those had to come home with me, but I didn't buy everything. I saw these and thought, yep, it's about time to replace my pads. So I grabbed these for $5.49. They're just cutting pads to use. And then I saw this paper for $2.99. And you, you know, you don't get very much. And it is super thin, but it's so cute. It's got the Murray's on it. I mean, how do you leave that at the store? I love this car and her. Oh, so cute. And then this is the back, which is just like a tuxedo. So this came home with me. I found lots and lots of goodies. Oh my goodness, I almost forgot the cool graphic 45 stuff. Can you wait just a minute? I know we're at 16 minutes. I can't believe I almost forgot this stuff. Thank you for hanging out for a minute, but it's worth the wait. $4.99 for these black ATC alphabet banners. Look at this. Here's the picture right there. See that? It's double-sided, the front and the back. And let me get these out. These are tiny. So it comes with this string right here. Not string, it's ribbon. And then this size right here. Look at this. Oh, that's the ampersand sign. <laughs> Here's a Z. Isn't that neat? So they're they're they are very small. They're not quite two and a half, probably just over two and a quarter wide. And they are one, two, just over three inches with this top bit here. But I thought if you didn't want to use alphabets, you could totally use it as a tag and cover just this part, like cut a square for each side and have it as a tag for a banner. I'm, I'm sorry, a banner, a mini album, or even a scrapbook layout, you know, whatever you want. So, I mean, they're all the same. So maybe to somebody else, it's not that great of a deal. I did think it would be cool if you could flip them over, but you can't really read the letters that way, so that kind of stinks, but... I still think using them and covering them with a square of paper is still going to be plenty exciting for the ones that I don't want to use for a banner. But definitely, I could definitely see using this at Halloween time. Or if you have somebody's birthday and you just use the initials off their gift and then put like another tag under it with the message. Super cute. Super worthy. I think. What do you think? Do you like them? Let me know below if you do or don't. Also, look at this. Graphic 45 craft paper. Hello, you can't see it. <laughs> there you go. It's late, y'all. I'm so tired right now. But I'm here because I need to show you guys this cool stuff so you guys can go find it if you want it. I mean, that's why I do this, right? So this is craft paper and you can see right here it is 19.5 times 27 inches there is two pieces of paper that size in here you just open it up it's double-sided look at that see that it's like wrapping paper but it's paper because it's, it's still pretty thin but this is like the perfect size to mod podge this on to um you know, a book like chipboard if you want to make a, a book with it or even the inside of an actual book. Like if you're making a journal or a mini album out of a real book, you could use this to go on the inside. Um, chipboard, canvases, anything. So I thought that was super cool and I can't wait to use it. So there's a SKU number for that one. It's a bicycles. Here's the SKU number for this one right here. And this one is, so it's got this lovely print. It's really hard to get it all in frame because I can't. And then it's got these type keys on the back. And like I said, it's super thin, so it'd be easy to mod podge. But this is the typograph. So, 
really neat. And then there was this one right here. Here's the number for this one. And, this it. and it's just a dictionary paper. Isn't that neat? Put them on the side. We got all these sentiments. Missy. To draw, you must close your eyes and sing. Oh. So. That was awesome, right? Some really cool finds. And the last thing that I picked up was this 12 by 12 by Echo Park. And it comes with four 12 by 12, three 4 by 6, like each one's 4 by 6, and then three of the 3 by 4 pockets. And it's pineapples. Pineapples. They did have um, lots of other ones. Here's the number and the price, $7.99. It's a SKU number. They did have um, some like baby girl ones, baby boy ones, traveling ones, but I was really, really good and only just got the one for now. That's just in case my husband's watching. But then he heard me say that part, so it doesn't count. <laughs> All right, guys, it's late. I'm so tired, and I hope you enjoyed this haul, seeing what's out there. I hope you can find it close to you if you haven't already, and I hope you're finding some goodies, and if you're, you know, making videos, please let me know so I can watch them, because I would love to see what you guys are finding. That's what's great about YouTube. All right, check you out later. Bye!